بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم 015 grammar unit 4 lesson 4 the simple past tense the learning objectives dear students by the end of this lesson you will be able to form and use the simple past tense in yes no questions form and use the simple past tense in wh questions the simple past tense yes no questions Begin your yes no question with did with all personal pronouns i you we they he she it or with the singular or plural form of nouns so start your question with did plus the subject again the subject could be a noun or a pronoun plus the base form of the verb after that complete your question so again start your question with did plus the subject plus the base form of the verb examples did you find your keys notice here that the question starts with did followed by the subject followed by the base form of the verb this is very important you have to use the base form of the verb when the question starts with the verb did did you find your keys the answer yes i did yes i did i found them in my pocket notice here that the answer must also be in the past another example Did Nawaf buy the tickets? Again, notice here that the question starts with did, followed by the subject. Here, the subject is a noun. After that, you have to use the base form of the verb, buy. Did Nawaf buy the tickets? No, he didn't. Nawaf didn't buy the tickets. Notice also that after the negative word didn't, we use also the base form of the verb. We use the base form of the verb. Be careful. Use the base form with did. So whenever you use the helping verb did, you have to use the base form of the verb. The simple past tense. WH questions. Begin your WH question with a question word like what, where, when, who, why, how, what time, etc. Then use the same word order as in yes, no question. So. Here, start the question with the WH word plus did plus the subject. Again, the subject could be a noun or a pronoun, the subject. Plus, again, the base form of the verb. We use the base form. We use the base form of the verb. After that, complete your question. So, again, start the question with a question word, followed by did, followed by the subject, and again, the subject could be a pronoun or a noun. After that, you have to use the base form of the verb. Again, why? Because of did. Whenever you use the auxiliary verb did, you have to use the base form of the verb. After that, complete your question. Examples. What time did your class begin? Notice here that the question starts with a question word, followed by did, followed by subject, followed by the base form of the verb, begin. Begin is the base form of the verb. The answer, my class began at 8 o'clock. Notice here that the answer is in the past. Another example. Why did you run? Notice here that the question starts with a question word, followed by the helping verb did, followed by the subject, followed by the base form of the verb. Why did you run? The answer, because I was late. Notice here that the answer is in the past. Another example. What did Linda buy? Again, notice that we start the question with a question word, followed by the helping verb did, followed by the subject, followed by the base form of the verb. What did Linda buy? The answer, she bought a car. Notice here that the answer is in the past. Thank you for listening.